Good morning, YouTube. What is going on? And I know it's been a long, 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 long. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let me get this light right. Take a step back. It's been a long time, guys. So I want you guys to sit back and enjoy this ride. And I'll talk to you guys soon. Alrighty, guys. So here at Wally World. About to pick up some containers, some uh, moving containers. So uh, let's go in here and see what I can find. Alrighty, guys, check it out, man. Oh my God, what is that? Go Gators. All right, all right. Yeah, man. So, guys, got a little bit of packing done. Got my containers over there. And cleaned up. Still got shoes I got to put up. So, I'll holler at you guys in the next clip. What is going on, guys? So, man, currently sitting in the parking lot at Nike. About to finish up a long shift. I got an eight hour shift, man. Really don't feel like going in here, but uh, you know, gotta get this paper because I got a big move coming up. So, trying to get as much money as possible so I can kind of chill and relax for a little bit. So, uh, stay tuned, guys, and I'll see you guys later on. Maybe, um, on my lunch break or something like that I come back out here and uh, pick up the camera and talk to you guys for a little bit so see you in a little bit <sighs> what is going on YouTube yes it is the next day I apologize but man your boy has been busy and I have been moving so man just want to give y'all an update man let me catch my breath for a little bit man cuz just got home it's currently around 730 um, September 3rd, man, the, the months are going by pretty, pretty quick, and, um, the year is almost over with, and come to think about it, it's the ninth month, um, so we got, what, September, we got October, November, and December, and this month will be up, wow, it's crazy, 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 um, but, yeah, guys, um, decided, like I say, this weekend, I said I'm going to try to get a video up for you guys by Sunday night. And that's kind of what I'm doing. So I got a few hours to tell you guys uh, what's been going on and then upload this video. So with that being said, guys, um, if you don't know, um, I said it yesterday, but um, I'm actually currently moving from Nashville, Tennessee. I'm actually moving my talent and myself to Dallas, Texas. Um, be Dallas, Fort Worth, Arlington area, uh, more Arlington. Um, I'm about a mile and a half away from the Dallas Cowboys Stadium, and right there, about Six Flags and a water park. Um, if you're familiar with the Dallas area, so that definitely I think it'll be Arlington, but um, uh, Dallas, Texas is right down the way. But, um, pretty excited about that. It's a big move, big, big, big move, and a big risk that I'm taking. But hey, man. Life is about taking risks and, you know, growing and learning. So with that being said, I picked up a job or I took a job opportunity with this company called Camp Gladiators, um, which I'll be doing boot camps, fit camps, and things like that down in Arlington, uh, Arlington Texas. So I have to go down there and finish some more stuff up um, next Sunday or start off next Sunday. Um so that's that. That's the move. And uh, we'll talk a little bit more leading up to it and things like that. But yeah, I am moving. Um, to catch you guys up on what's been going on with me and what I've been doing. Um, working. <laughs> working. Um, actually, my last day of training here in Nashville. Um, you know, for Fitness 1440, if you didn't know, the green and black gym uh, was Friday. And, man, my time there was great. I um, met a lot of great people, man. Um, all my clients that I had. All, I believe I had about 50, 50 to 55 maybe in all within the year that I was there. 
Um, so it was pretty good, man. Uh, build a lot of relationship with those people. So if you're watching this video, guys, um, all my clients out there, man, I love you guys. And you guys rock. You were the best. The ones who stuck with me, the ones who didn't. Um, you know, I still rock with you guys. And I hope that you're still on that right path of bettering yourself. Because that's all, I ha that's all I'm here for is to motivate you and help you and educate you on how to be the best you and also how to learn how to um you know change you know change ways change your way of living health workout wise um that way you don't go into a gym and you're feeling like you don't know what what's going on my main focus with all my clients is to teach them um how to use the equipment to their needs that way they can go into any gym and not worry about looking lost or feeling uncomfortable or not feeling confident about themselves. That's that's more of the type of training style that I go with. And I think that's what kind of makes me a little bit more, uh, that kind of stands me out a little bit. You know, I'm not the drill sergeant. I can be the drill sergeant, but I'm not the drill sergeant. I'm more of a chill, laid back, but I'm going to push you. And I want to push you mentally compared to physically because physically is going to come but we're not here just to kill you you know we're here to push you past your past your comfort zone but also too i want that confidence and education so that's a little bit about that so i've been taking care of those clients um whether they counseled whether they went over to another trainer um so that's that um on that note uh last week i put my two weeks in for nike which this is the first week of nike so i got one more week well, two more days. I work next Friday and next Saturday. And that will be my last um, work days here in Nashville at the Nike Brentwood store. So that's coming to an end as well. As um, far as last month, what would I do? Um, I went to New York. Me and Muscles went to New York. She, I supported her and her job and her career. Um, you know, she's into aviation and air traffic control. So she has some opportunities to go out to uh, New York and you know shadow a couple of airlines and things like that which is pretty cool um, and she enjoyed that time and I was just you know the backbone you know being there and being like I say the good person that I am and the good boyfriend that I am so that was that uh, the week after we came back worked a week I actually drove down to Dallas Texas to start moving some of my stuff down there so um, I kind of knew that I was moving um, Probably close to about three to about, we can say about three four weeks ago, I kind of made my decision, but it wasn't real and it's still not real to me right now. So I still got some uh, uh, adjusting to do once I actually get down there because I still feel like you know I'm just going down there to visit kind of thing. So um, I started packing up some of my stuff. I'm gonna finish packing up the rest of my stuff this week. Um, so that's that. Uh, as far as my health. This is one thing I want to talk to you guys about and let you guys know. Um, my health hasn't been the best. Um, when I say that, it's not been the best to my needs. Um, other people look at me and say, oh, man, you're fine. You're okay. Um, you look great. Um, I think those are the people that are close to me and they care about me and things like that. But I'm the type of person that um, I'm a little bit more harder on myself than anybody. And... Uh, when those things occur, man, um, there comes a point in time, man, where, you know, I, you kind of lose track of, you know, your health and things like that. And where I'm going with this, I know I'm just kind of going all over the place with this, but where I'm going with this, guys, with this move, um, with the decision that I made, it was kind of hard for me to break it off to my last, my last, uh, employer, um, which we had a partnership, so I really didn't want to go through that whole rebuilding process again. So I had to really think hard and long on, like, man, do I really want to do this? And I actually came through with that. That was a lot. Um, you know, telling all my clients was a lot, you know, because I've told some of my clients that, hey, I won't be leaving. I think I'm here for good. Nothing, something came up, and then boom, you know, so I kind of felt sad and I kind of felt bad. Uh, within myself because I told them something, but I really didn't know that I was actually going to take this opportunity. Um, two, you know, Cabrina, um, K Muscles, um, talking to her and, you know, really just, honestly, I've just been spending time, a lot of time with her, working. Um, I have been doing a little bit more boxing training. 
um, hitting the heavy bag, um, because I just kind of got burnt out, and it happens, um, it happens, and I think the way I was doing it, or the way I was going about it, um, I could have did it a little bit different, but man, I've been trying to stay on this path for so long, and, um, I don't know, man. It just just kind of burnt me out a little bit, and I just really didn't have no desire to work out. Last week, I tried to work out with some friends, and I just haven't been feeling it, man, because I've been so overwhelmed with uh, work, um, you know, trying to spend time with loved ones, and also, too, you know, the weekend job, which is Nike, so... I mean, all that stuff, man, has kind of been hitting heavy and heavy. And now this week, um, you know, I got some more things I got to go do. I go pick up um, some, you know, personal items and things that I've lost um, that I got to go kind of replace uh, for the state of Tennessee. That way I can have that when I get ready to go. Um, If you're wondering, I will be staying with a family member in Dallas. Um, so that's going to be great. That's going to help me help me out a lot. I'll be saving some money and some funds until I get on my feet, until I can adjust. Um, what else? What else? Yeah, haven't been working out. Haven't been eating really, really too healthy. Um, I'm going to say semi. I'm going to say I've probably been eating, I would say 50-50. Water and taking all that stuff hasn't been the best, but I do plan on getting on that this week because um, this week I'm not actually going to be working that much. Um, it's kind of hard for me just to sit still in one place, so um, that's one thing. Another thing is I've been working on online, launching that, which is another cool thing. Um, was uh, like I said, I am going online with the online training, um, so. If you are out there and you've been watching some of my videos and you support your boy, um, yes, I do online coaching. And I decided um, to do this about a month ago. So on my last video, I, excuse me, last two videos, I think I posted it. Well, it could have been the last video. I was like, hey, you know, I've been working on that. Um, the clothing line is still something that... I am currently still working on. It's just taking a little bit, and I'm trying to. Hopefully, when I go to Texas, I can find a good distributor to help me, and I can get it for a you know, pretty good price. That way, I can actually be profitable um, to everyone. So that's that, and I think that's it, man. This week, I plan on you know getting back on track, um, spending a lot of time with my mom. Um, Spending a lot of time trying to go see my other family members, my other brothers, um, my grandparents, and muscles, and all my other friends. Um, So this week is going to be another busy week. Just working out with people. So be expecting, you know, workout videos, just meetups, um, and things like that. So, uh... That's it, guys. I think, you know, this is a cool little video. Um, kind of just wanted to vent to you guys, let you guys know what's been going on. And the moral of the story is I have been working behind the scenes because I have a big move. It's a big move to me because I never left, I never left out of Nashville. And also, too, been trying to handle some stuff. So with that being said, guys, I'm going to end this video here. And I'll pick up this video or pick back up on my videos tomorrow which will be September 4th. So I'll see you guys later. And I'm going to play a few clips of New York and Dallas. So stay tuned for that.